Alright, welcome back everyone. I'm playing more Game of Thrones and uh, I just want to get straight back into this. I've, I've kind of I missed it in the three seconds that I wasn't playing it. We just left our uh, lord. And we're going to basically... Uh, we, he basically gave us his sword. Look at this. And he's uh, basically telling us to go and tell our Uncle Duncan, Duncan something. But we can only tell him. Um, yeah, so what I'm basically going to do with this series, if you haven't seen the first one, um, basically what I'm doing is I'm going to do it exactly as the character, what, what I would do if I was actually that character myself. I'm not going to try and do anything that like I would like, well this is the right thing to do, this is the right thing to do. I'm doing it what the actual, I think, in my position, if I was him, what I would actually do and what I think would be the right thing to do. Um, I think that's a good way of looking at this game. It's the same way in the first Telltale games when someone was me. Uh, everyone would pick, uh, you know, what they would do as the. It was harder in obviously season two because it's like, what would I do as a character? You don't know how, uh, you know, I didn't know how to act. It was easier with the Big Big Wolf, but then again, you don't know what's going to be actually just this one. It might be a little bit easier because they're just plain humans, just like Lee was. So I'm going to be just exactly that. But what a cool uh, opening sequence. I uh, hope I didn't ruin it just by talking from but if you want to see it, it's going to be everywhere. Um, I believe Cry and Cinnamon Toast Ken are doing a series of this right now. The Forester Lands. King's Road. A telltale story by Andrew Grant and Ryan Kaufman. Good man, Martin. Good man, Joe. How you doing? Good man, Piggy. Ah, Pega. Characters are so far fun. Oh, we get to move. We finally get to move. Hey, Piggy. Uh, uh, uh. Yeah, you get out of the fucking way, Piggy. What's that? Look at the blood. Mm. Blood? Why would there be blood at Pig Farm Incorporated? Fresh. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so let's keep going. It's probably from this pig. Probably. Okay, so we're gonna follow the smoke while walking. Um, the sword's pretty bellious. It's a great sword. I would love, I would have loved to have had a great sword like that playing Dark Souls or maybe some other RPG uh, role playing games, but maybe just play with this one might be cool. We have to give it back it's to the leader. Gone. Father? I, I really don't know the story that well. Uh, so if I'm getting things wrong here or there, I'm sorry. Lord Bolton better give us fucking titles for this. Winter may be coming, but at least still have his bacon. Again, I'm gonna do it in the situation that way. Dude, you, right? That's my favorite pig. That was Lucy. That was Lucy Pig. Move along, boy. There's nothing for you here. It's my fucking farm. Father, I said move on. Unless you want to get fed to the fucking pigs. Fucking draw a sword. I'm going to kill you. Wait, is that the wrong thing to do? Is that so? You can try if you like. Is that the and wrong thing to do? Feed you to the pigs. Get off my land. This is Bolton land now, boy. Lord Bolton is the new warden of the north. I reckon he'd like a proper lordly sword like that. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, it's my fucking no, father. Man. I'll have that sword, boy. You won't have the sword. Fuck you. Fuck you. Yeah. What do I do? I want to kill this fucker. I really want to kill him. I really want to kill this motherfucker. <laughs> So badly. All right. Finish this fucking pig farmer. Pathetic. The sword. You really are a pig farmer. <laughs> oh, do you like that? Do you like that a lot? 
I just noticed you can use both analog sticks. That's pretty cool. Oh, my sword. Gotta get my sword. Oh, that's my leg. Mashy mashy, smashy trashy. Oh, I hope I kill this guy. Oh. Here we go. Mercy, please. Mercy. I beg of you. I have a family. I survive without me. I understand I what no mercy is. You. It's this. No, please. <laughs> Fuck you, man. Lord Whitefield will see you hang for this. That Go get him. I promise. <laughs> they deserved it. <laughs> Greatly. Garrett, you survived. Your sister. She hid. I tried to stop them. I'll kill wow. the men who did this. I don't know if you would have done that in my situation, but I think, uh, I don't know, I felt like killing them. <laughs> they deserved every second of what I did. That guy, when I hit him in the back of the head, I think he was like, oh shit, but really deserved it. It's badass. Is this in the film, the dub in the show? It's Garrett. Get the Castellan. Tell him his nephew survived. I uh, watch Robas and he says Castle Rock. Is that what it is? Castle Rock? I don't know what it is. Carrot. Fraggle Rock. I was too late. They were already dead. Bring the Maester. Meet us in the Great Hall. Quickly. I have the sword. It's really hurting my back. If you could take it off my hands, that'd be great. Two White Hill soldiers and a Bolton. They killed my family. And for what? My sister, she... She was only eight years old. This never would See, have happened they deserved with it. in power. It's unimaginable. Unacceptable. You have my condolences. Thank you, Mister. Mm, the blade cut deep. But I should be able to save your leg. Your justice was swift. Some will call it vengeance. No doubt the White Hills will claim it was murder. It was your family. I can't say I would have done any different than you. But the White Hills won't see it that way. I'd do it again. again if I had the chance. If we don't respond with strength, they won't stop until they have everything. It's true. I don't know what that means, These but it's true. Ought to help prevent infection. Hold the wound open for me, would you? Oh, no, man. Do do it. Maggots. These are dark days, I fear. What? To lose the lord of the house and the <laughs> eldest son through such a despicable act of treachery and betrayal. Greater houses than ours have fallen in times such as this. The late Lord Forrester was a good man. And poor Roderick. A serious man, but he would have made a good lord. Well, what do we do now? The future of this house is in Lord Ethan's hands now. Although he is young and altogether unprepared to lead. Right. Uh, this might hurt a bit. Because he's sewing it up. Hold this for me, will you? I thought they were going to make me hold this from guess. your uncle that Lord Forrester saved like your this. life. He did. Rather odd, though, that he chose to save you, his squire, and not his son, Roderick. Not that Roderick couldn't handle himself. 
He's as good with a sword as any man I've seen. It's unfortunate the Citadel doesn't train maesters in the art of Warcraft. That's not how it happened. Roderick had already fallen. Hmm. Well, I'd imagine Lord Forrester would sacrifice himself to save anyone from his house, high or low. Lady Forrester will be here any moment now. She I'd cute? I'd like you to walk for me first, to see if you can put any weight on that leg. <sighs> Go on. Don't stop now. It's better to let the blood circulate. Look at the medical supplies. Um. So yeah, uh, this game has been so much fun so far. Basically, if you want this game, uh, mm, I'll pick up these. I guess maybe. This what it's been. Uh, what it's been on, I guess all the time. If you want to say that, I guess what it's been. What it's on is on PS4. I think it's gonna be on PS3 next week. I think. It's on the 9th, I think it's going to be on the PS3. Let's go back out and look at this chair, I guess. Look at the Lord's chair. Hmm. You seem to be favoring it. Always sad to see a warrior lose a leg. I, I'm fine, Maestro Tengren. Look. Um. So yeah, I, I was saying I, 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 don't, I don't watch Game of Thrones. But if, if I'm sure if it doesn't... Uh, spoil anything in this game, I will definitely go and watch it, because this seems fucking awesome already. I'm looking at the window. The Ironwood Grove. And already they fixed a lot of things that I didn't like about the original game. I feel like a lot of talk to the master when you're finished exploring. Okay. Very much so. Is this the master? Are you the master? Master, yes. Talk to. Did your leg feel weak? No. No. I just wanted to ask you. Um. Who is the new lord of this house? The new lord of House Forester. Why, Ethan, of course. Ethan. Are you kidding me? At the Citadel. I swore an oath to serve whichever noble house I was assigned. Advising the late Lord Forrester was an honor. Advising Ethan, his third-born son, is challenging. Mm, There's still I bet. so much he has his to learn. Name. Yet the very fate and future of this house rests in his hands. Which is rather frightening when you think about it. What, what will become of me? Now? Excellent question. Hmm. Under normal circumstances, you could join Sir Roiland and his men. Although, given the circumstances of your... circumstances, it becomes a bit tricky, doesn't it? I suppose it will be for Lord Ethan to decide. Well, Lord Forrester promoted me. At the Twins, I... I'm no longer a squire, if that matters. It might, I suppose. But I'll defer to Lord Ethan on this. They're not gonna believe you. Um... Can I see Ethan? Ethan? Is he here? He is, but I'm afraid he's indisposed at the moment. He prefers not to be disturbed while practicing his loot. Okay, very well. Um, Can I go now? Here. I believe your leg will be fine. Any time will tell, but... How's this stuff? Lady Forrester. Welcome home, Garrett. We're all relieved to know you survived. Thank you, my lady. Tell your eyes to see you. Garrett, I heard what happened. Is it true? Oh, is she too young? Your family... She... She's seven and... Oh, God damn it. God damn it, Calvin. I'm so sorry. Me too. Off to bed now. Hurry on. Garrett okay. was just telling me how valiantly Lord Forrester fought to the end. Even when all was lost. I'm sure Lady Forrester would like to know. Whatever you can recall. He loved his family, my lady. He was very proud of Roderick. Yet he was unable to save him. You were with Roderick, no? I'm sure it was chaos and confusion. But if you can remember anything... He... 
He fought valiantly, my lady. He did. I saw him fighting valiantly. He, did. he was House Forrester's best. I'm the best. This has been so incredibly difficult for us, especially the children. But I was told. I was told you were the last to see my husband alive. Yes, my lady. I know it may be difficult to remember, but if I may ask, was there anything he said? Any last words before he passed? If you can remember. He asked me to return this to House Forrester. He said this is where it belongs. With his family. Thank you, Garrett. Of course, my lady. It demands a response. It's too dangerous, especially now. Now is the time to prove our strength. Okay, uh, it's a weird place to end it, but uh, I want to keep these kind of short. So we're going to do that as kind of a cliffhanger type deal. But uh, yeah, thank you for watching. If you did watch, I uh, hope you enjoyed me uh, getting stuff and just filling up wounds and chopping people with axes. But uh, yeah, I'll see you in the next one if you do want to tune in. Peace out, bro. I don't know what my outro is yet. Uh, I think it's uh, thank you for watching. If you did watch, you didn't do that. It was very kind. Yep. <laughs>